Taoism gets a heavy influence from Buddhism, but it also has many connections to Confucianism, Chinese cultural religions, ancient and inner alchemy, shamanism, and other historical movements. Taoists and Buddhists both put an extreme amount of emphasis on spirituality and the fact that you are connected spiritually to your family and ancestors. Buddhists believe that life itself is filled with suffering, while Taoists believe that life is good and living is a great thing and we should treasure every moment that we are lucky enough to live. In order to reach Dukkha, one must reach Nirvana. One must stop the process of rebirth and that way they can reach the nothingness in which they were made. Tao is advised to concentrate on life itself. The longer you live, the more saintly you become, unlike Buddhism, who see existence as suffering. Buddhists believe that life goes on and on, and there is an infinite amount of rebirths until you can reach Nirvana. While Taoists want to achieve harmony with nature and the universe and spend as much time as they can living life as long as they can. Taoists believe that actions of our ancestors have direct repercussions in this life. Though the path to Tao and the path to Nirvana are different, they also have some similarities as well. They both have inner light which guides a person in the right direction so they can succeed in reaching their goal. You must lose all personal desires and free your mind from clutter to let your inner light guide you. The path to Tao comes from within, while the path to Nirvana is by using the guidelines that Buddha set up, which can be found in the Eightfold Path. Both religions believe in some form of reincarnation. Taoists believe that birth is not a beginning and that death is not an end. The soul is eternal. It isn't reborn. It does not die, but rather migrates to another life. Buddhists believe within the theory that the soul is not reborn but they believe that it comes back depending on the kind of karma that you have created for yourself. Both religions believe that you must achieve harmony with nature and the universe in order to reach the ultimate goal. They both reject the caste system, better use the term social hierarchies. Strictly speaking, the caste system is from India and the ideals that it stands for. Taoists place more thought and energy on what's going on in the body, while Buddhists are more concerned with the mind. Taoism uses the yin yang to represent everything that we basically come in touch with on a daily basis. Taoists see everything either as yin or yang and it can be applied to anything in the world. If something is yin then the opposite of it would be yang. Each is intermingled also with the other. There being some yin and yang, yang and yin and each replaces the other with time. As you can see both religions have many similarities and differences, but it is very evident that since their meetings, both religions have learned a great deal from each other, and that, because of its many people, have become more enlightened and religiously fulfilled. To become completely happy and enlightened, you must either reach Nirvana and Tao, and it is clear that both religions have a great deal of self-restraint and hard work to achieve what each religion is striving for. As time goes on, it is easy to see that both religions will keep learning from each other and keep intertwining the ideas and thoughts because we can always learn and expand our thoughts and ideas from others and what better way to do it than with two religions that competed for superiority for many years. <laughs>